Hello, dear students. Welcome to our online English school. The topic of today's lesson is to be good at sports. Let's start. You will listen and watch the video now. While listening, I ask you to pay attention to the use of the phrase to be good at. And also pay attention to the use of comparative adjectives in the video. Listen and watch. It's noisy in the park today. There are more people than last week. That's because the weather is sunny today. It was worse yesterday. It rained all day, didn't it? And there are more ducks on the lake today. Aren't they sweet? Look, that man's throwing a ball into the lake. The ducks are going away. He's better at throwing than me. Yes, and look at his dog. It's going to get the ball. It's really good at swimming. Dogs love swimming. Don't you know that? Yes, of course I do. <laughs> Now I want to pay attention to the use of the phrase to be good at sports. And also we will look at comparative degree of adjectives. From the last lesson, you remember that for one syllable adjectives, to make a comparative degree, we need to use the adjective and add suffix er. For example, noisy, noisier. You also remember that for the adjectives ending in y, we need to change the letter y into i. Noisy, noisier. Very good. Now, be careful, please. Look at these words. Bad, good, a lot, and many. To make comparative degree of these adjectives, we can't apply the same rule. We cannot add suffix er to make comparative degree of these adjectives because these words are exceptions. So, to make a comparative degree of these adjectives, we will use these words. Worse, better and more. You need to remember them and learn them by heart. So, please repeat after me. Bad, worse. Bad, worse. For example, the weather was worse yesterday. Good, better. Good, better. For example, he is better at throwing than me. A lot, more. Many, more. For example, there are more ducks in the lake today. So, you need to learn them by heart. Again, repeat please. Bad, worse. Good, better. A lot, more. Many, more. Very good. Now I want you to pay attention to the use of these phrases. He is better at throwing than me. It means he is good at throwing. Second example. It is really good at swimming. It means that the dog is really good at swimming. Very good. Now listen to the instructions carefully. Listen and choose. It's noisy in the park today. There are more people than last week. That's because the weather is sunny today. It was worse yesterday. It rained all day, didn't it? And there are more ducks on the lake today. Aren't they sweet? Look, that man's throwing a ball into the lake. The ducks are going away. He's better at throwing than me. Yes, and look at his dog. It's going to get the ball. It's really good at swimming. Dogs love swimming. Don't you know that? Yes, of course I do. And let's check. Excellent. Listen and complete. You see four sentences and you need to complete them with the words given. The words are 
better, worse, bad, good, more, a lot of. Are you ready? Good, let's start. I'm good at singing, but he's better than me. Let's listen again to this sentence and check. I'm good at singing, but he's better than me. Very good. Next sentence. She's bad at running, but I'm worse than her. Let's listen again and check. She's bad at running, but I'm worse than her. OK, next sentence. John's got a lot of friends at school, but Sally's got more than him. Now let's listen and check. John's got a lot of friends at school, but Sally's got more than him. Very good. Next sentence. Is there a lot of work to do today? No, but there's more to do tomorrow. Let's listen and check. Is there a lot of work to do today? No, but there's more to do tomorrow. Very good. Now we will practice completing these sentences with these three adjectives. Bad, good, a lot. But for this activity, we need to revise comparative degree of these adjectives. Do you remember comparative degrees of bad, good, a lot? Listen to the instructions, please. Complete. Now let's start. For the first two sentences, we need to use the word bad and its comparative degree. This rain is bad. Do you remember its comparative degree? Yes. But snow is worse. Let's see what we have. This rain is bad. Yes. But snow is worse than rain. Very good. Next sentence. We need to use the word good and its comparative degree. This chocolate tastes good. Yes, but my ice cream tastes better than yours. Let's see what we have. This chocolate tastes good. Yes, but my ice cream tastes better than yours. Next sentence. Have you got a lot of homework? Yes, and they've got, do you remember comparative degree of adjective a lot? More, very good. Yes, and they've got more to do tomorrow. Let's see what we have. Have you got a lot of homework? Yes, and they've got more to do tomorrow. Let's check. Excellent. Now let's revise what you have learned today. Look at the words from lesson 1. Which sport you are good at? To be good at aerobics. To be good at skiing. To be good at skating. To be good at cycling. To be good at basketball. To be good at volleyball. To be good at parachuting. To be good at paintball. To be good at running. At home, I ask you to answer the question, which sport are you good at? Please, use this prompt to make sentences. I'm good at, for example, I'm good at swimming. And the phrase, I am better at than, for example, I am better at swimming than running. You did an excellent job today. The lesson is over. See you next week. Goodbye.